Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be taking you to my favorite Dollar Tree. This one is located on Maysville Road here in Fort Wayne, Indiana. It is over 13,000 square feet. I was able to find all of these brand new Valentine items for 2022 at my Dollar Tree. I posted one a little over a week ago. I will link that one down below, but everything in this video is brand new for Valentine's and that'll be it on this video, but it's about 18 minutes long. So I hope you all enjoy and I will see you at the Dollar Tree. All right, we're gonna start out with these. You get a two pack. They're in the shape of like a gift tag. They're a pretty good size. They had it in the red. They also have it in the pink and the black and white, and that is glitter with the X's and O's. I thought these were really cute. These are barn wood signs. They are six and a half by six and a half. I'm not sure if there's any other colors, but these are the two that they had. And I think this one was really, really cute. This one is about a 13 by eight and a half. Love you to the moon and back. And then they had, hey, you're cute. This one is like in the shape of a gift tag as well. Some glitter. There's another mason jar sign. Those are the same size as what they had around um, the fall decor. This one's really cute. Lots and lots of glitter with the hearts in the tree with the owl. You can always flip it over and do something else on the other side, like maybe a family tree. This is a new one. This had a lot of glitter there on the bottom with the plaid heart. And this one has a bunch of the sequins. And then over here, there's another new sign. Oh, and another one. They also had, I like you a lot. I like you a lot. And they had these pick glitter hearts. They had it in pink and red. Okay, so these are the four like tag signs I was able to find. This is one of the walls full of Valentines and I am zooming in onto this adorable gnome. Kind of about the same size as what they had around Christmas time very fluffy beard a lot of tinsel stuff and there's the truck and let's go see what's over here so we have this heart shape with the flowers with the xo in the middle with glitter I showed that one in my last video, so let's move over here to Love You Always. Pretty good size sign. If I had a guess, I would say probably about 12 inches. And then they had this one with the love with the glitter. And then they had this heart-shaped one that says kisses. And this one says love. And another love. This is the back wall of the Valentine stuff, and they will be putting more stuff out here very soon. I think this sign's really cute. Kisses, 25 cents. This is a beautiful blue that says, love you with the heart. And I really like the saying of this, forever is too short with you. I think that's an amazing, amazing statement. And here they have the love with the red arrows. For those doggy moms, look at these. These are really cute. These are about six by five and a half. Lots of glitter, so you might have to brush some of that off. Thought this one was really cute as well. Home sweet home with the paw print glitter. And then your heart belongs to me. And that one's about 11 and a half by nine. Here's a little camper sign with the X's and O's and it says, be my Valentine. And then you have the truck done in plaid with the hearts in the back with different sayings on them. 
And then you have these heart wreaths. Again, a lot of glitter. This one's pretty cute. It's different. You uncover your flower there that they put a little plastic bulb thing over it to protect it. And then they had that pink one. And then they had these hearts, the polka dots. And then you have a bunch of hearts on this one. And then you have the X's and O's. It says hug me and the glitter in the middle there. And then sweetheart. Look at this velvet ribbon. You get one yard. So they had it in the red, white, black, and pink. Ooh, this is a really long sign. Again, a lot of glitter. A lot of people say to put hairspray on these so they don't flake everywhere. And this is another back wall full of Valentines. So let's start up here. This one says love, which I don't think it has to be for Valentines. It's a pretty good size and has some good weight to it. You also have this cupcake. It says sweet love. Again, a lot of glitter. <clears throat> And then we have the Happy Valentine's Day. And here's another Happy Valentine's Day. The Be Mine. You hold the key to my heart. That one's cute. You can always dissect it if you want. And look at the little hole there on the bottom. And they also had it in pink. The key to happiness is love. And then they have the longer signs over here. These are about the same size that they had like for Easter, fall, Halloween. I like you a lot. <clears throat> and then they had these two down here. This one has the galvanized heart on there with the X's and O's. They also had these yard stakes that you could put in your yard or you can hang them on your wall or put them in flower pots. It's however you want to display them. They do have ribbons on them. So you have the be mine in the pink, hug me in the blue. And then they have the love in the purple. And sweetheart in the red. Down here, they have one of the longer heavy-duty signs, and it says, You are perfect in every way. Over here, we have some tinsel friends. Except this, Rosé. Interesting. And we have a little doggy. Oh, look at that. It's holding a little sign that says love in the mouth. Now that is really cute with the heart on its side. Then we have his buddy, the unicorn with love with a fancy tail. And then we have the dinosaur holding a red heart. And are those fingers? What is that? Are those human finger things? I don't know. That's kind of creepy. What was that? This one was actually my favorite one. I was so close to getting it, but I passed on it. But oh my gosh. Why do I find that cute? I don't know. Kind of weird looking. <laughs> but I thought the way it was standing was really cute. And then the last one, we have a um, messy, dirty note. Looks like he had a rough night in the box. Look at that. Poor little buddy. So there they are, just hanging out on the shelf. Watch you walk by. Over here, they have some flower pots with glitter hearts sticking out of them. So you have this red one, and they also have it in the pink and white actually pretty cute 
And there they are. Hanging out. They had these. These are new. They all have a clip there on the bottom. And this set comes with three red hearts. You can bend them and pose them. And then they had these pink ones, which I don't know if they're missing any hearts, if that's what it's supposed to look like. I'm not 100% sure. Then over here we have the red. And this one has different shapes of hearts. And, oh, okay, so this one's different too. Little sucker went and let go. There you go. So it looks like you get six hearts on that one. And then the pink ones were almost all gone. Again, you get three of them. They're pretty good size. So I went ahead and clipped them here on the shelf to give you a better idea on what they would look like if you stuck them on something, like in a um, wreath or some kind of display. Just to give you a little better idea on how you can bend them and pose them. Oh, and I found these pink hearts, too, just like the red ones. So, yeah, this is the whole gang. Sticking together. Over here, we have the handmade Valentine's greeting cards. These always make great gifts to give to someone. Super cute. And there's the pug. So yeah, I'm just going to show you really quick, just here on the back wall, all of these wonderful decors for your home or office. Again, they will be putting out a bunch more. Their truck was delayed, so I think it's pretty well stocked if you ask me for not having a truck for a week. And then right over here, they had a little bit more of the Valentines. Then here on the end cap is where I found the doggy and kitty stuff. And then they had this aisle, which I will take you down right now. Here they have a six foot garland. Looks like there's different shades of pink and red hearts. They also have these uh, treat bags. This one had the gnome. You get 20 of them. They're 11 and a half by five. And then they also had the Valentine's one there. One with just hearts and the other one had the bigger hearts. Here you get a 30 pack of the smaller Ziploc treat bags. And those are 3.8 by 5.75. Here you have some heart straws. You get six per pack, yellow, pink, and red. I bought these, I think it was last year, and blew them up. And um, yeah, these definitely look like something else <laughs> when they are blown up. I'll just leave it there. <clears throat> but they're pretty cool, though. Big. And, oh, wait. What's down here? These are the LED table decor, little wood light up figuring thingies. So here we have the bear holding a heart. And then you have the truck that says happy Valentine's Day with the XOXO on the license plate. And a mermaid sitting on a rock holding some hearts. So I'm going to go ahead and turn these on to give you a better idea on what they look like. And you can always paint them too. So here they are, all lit up. I think the bear lights up the best. And actually that was my favorite one. But yeah, that's what they look like. Over here you have the decorative mesh. You get three yards. Six inch by three yards like I stated. Here is the pink one, the darker pink. It looks like they have like snowflakes on them or whatever. The light pink, and I don't believe this red one belongs there. Nope, this red one is what belongs there. So I had to go over here and find the family of the red one, and right over here is where I found it. It is the glitter um, tule, I do believe. Is that what it's called? Tool? Tool. Tule. Oh my gosh. 
They had it in red, dark pink, light pink, and white. These are the LED string lights. They had these, I do believe, last year. You get 10 lights, and they are 3 feet long. They do take two AA batteries. I don't really care for these lights, but they're not bad. Here you have the color your own ornaments. Instead of a 5-pack, you get an 8-pack. So this heart is new this year. I do believe they had this one last year. And then they had this heart one, which is a little bit different. And these were, I think, three and a half by three and a half. I think this one's really cute. That one's pretty fancy. Look at all those little hearts hooked together. And then over here you have the paint set. You get three colors of paint and the paintbrush. These are ages five and up. You get red, white, and pink. And they also had this unicorn one that already has the red glitter on the mane. And the teddy bear holding a heart. It says, be mine. I like how they put these heart trays up here. You can usually find these over there by the crafter square aisle. These some cute little DIYs you can do with that with the Valentine stuff. And they also have the Valentine's paints over here, which is in light, light pink, dark pink, purple, white, and red. They also have the Crafter Square Clear Stamps. You get a 13-pack. Here they have these like foam roses. You get six per pack. They have this beautiful peach. They have it in cream or off-white, however you want to color it. And then you have the purple and red. And the light pink. They also have these signs. These were pretty solid. And this one says, you're cool. These would be go really cute with the other decor that I showed you on the back wall there. And then you had the BFS. BFFS. Yeah. The rainbow. Lots of glitter again. Oh, let's chill. These are new. These are some DIY wood boards that you can DIY, well, paint, whatever. It says, love you, looking sharp with the cactus. And then they have, I'm rooting for you, which I thought that was funny. And I'm a sucker for you. These are their felt stickers. You get 100 of them. I absolutely love these stickers. They come in white, red, and pink, and a few different sizes. They had these hanging up there on the plastic strip. You get a two pack. So this pack comes with these two. And this set, you get a purple one with this white one. And then they had one other set down here, the red and black. Be sure you always check these plastic strips down every single aisle, every end cap and every checkout lane because you never know what you might find. Okay, well, that's the end of our Dollar Tree trip. I sure hope you enjoyed it and you're able to find some goodies to jot down on to your wish list. If you want, why don't you go ahead and comment down below and let me know if you've seen something in hopes that you can find at one of your local Dollar Trees. If you enjoyed this video, I would love a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I would really love to have you. If you would like to follow me on Instagram or TikTok. I'll link those down below. As always, I want to say thank you for always taking the time out of your day to stop and watch my videos. So I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, safe Friday, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Keep smiling.